Welcome to Proofpoint's how-to video tutorial series, which is aimed at sharing best practices for configuring the Proofpoint Protection Server's features and functionalities. This video tutorial demonstrates how to delist a sender from the Proofpoint Dynamic Reputation block list within the Proofpoint Protection Server, or PPS. Proofpoint Dynamic Reputation, or PDR, is a connection management and email reputation service that uses Proofpoint Net MLX machine learning technology to block incoming connections from malicious IP addresses. The system provides enterprises with an accurate first-line defense against spam, directory harvest attacks, denial-of-service attacks, snowshoe spamming, and other email-borne threats while delivering substantial bandwidth savings. To delist an IP address from the Proofpoint Reputation Service, access the Dynamic Reputation Lookup site at https colon forward slash forward slash ipcheck.proofpoint.com. Input the IP address into the Lookup field and then click on the Lookup IP button. After you look up the IP address, you will be able to request a delisting for that IP. If mail from an IP address is vital to your organization's operations, create a PDR safe list policy route to have the Proofpoint Dynamic Reputation skip processing on the IP address immediately. This can be done by first navigating to the System tab, System module, and Policy Routes page. Create a policy route called PDR underscore safe or edit the policy route if it already exists. Add sender IP equals 127.0.0.2. If there are multiple IP addresses, you can use the joining term OR. Take note that the IP address 127.0.0.2 is only an example for this video. Please use the IP address that you want to bypass the block list with. Next, you will need to save and enable the policy route. Navigate to the Email Protection tab, Spam Detection Module, Reputation Service dropdown, and Settings page. As one of the Reputation Service options, select the checkbox for Disable Processing for Selected Policy Routes. Add the PDR underscore safe policy route to the Disable for Any of list and then click on the Save Changes button. Thank you for watching our brief how-to video tutorial on how to delist a sender from the Proofpoint Dynamic Reputation block list within the Proofpoint Protection Server, or PPS. For additional information on our product, visit our knowledge base at https colon forward slash forward slash proofpointcommunities.force.com. For questions, comments, or feedback on this tutorial, please email us at training at proofpoint.com.